Episode 3, I am so scared. He's French Canadian. Yes, French Canadian. Uh, I'm so scared. Okay. Let's do this. Let's do this. In the previous episodes of Life is Strange, oh, you missed it. called film Little Pieces of Time. I'm so sick of people trying to control me! Don't ever touch me again, freak! It totally makes sense. You hella saved my life. I think it's awesome you set a tongue record on video. <laughs> You're going to be sorry someday. And there she is. How are you doing, Max? Hi, Joyce. I am so sorry about William. I have great memories of him. That was his gift to us. Wonderful memories. Let's talk about your superpower. Hey, Stelma and Louise, you're my business now. That's and I... Rachel's bracelet. Why the fuck are you wearing her bracelet? You want me to cut you, bitch? Please, step back. You're kidding. Put that down. Please, get me out of here! Max! Nobody cares about me. Nobody. <laughs> What are you doing here, Max? Now, I know today was difficult for everybody. Miss Coffee, why exactly were you on the route with Kate Marsh? Please, tell us everything. What the hell is this? Max, there was no eclipse scheduled today. I believe you, Warren. I'll believe anything this week. I saved her because I'm a badass. Why are you, you got locked out of the house? That sucks, NASCAR. I'm sorry. I never played The Last of Us yet. NASCAR. Oh, I will shake her. Oh, I will. That ass I knew here. Chloe would be all over this, so I better get moving. Hey, Bunny. Kate will be back soon, and until then, I'll be catering to your every whim. Ah, uh, madhouse. See you later. Are you a hungry bunny? Here, nosh on this. I want a bunny. Oh, I'm sorry, Lisa. I saved Kate, but I drowned my own plant. Whoops. It's amazing how happy Kate looks here compared to today. She was basically pushed up to that roof, and I will use my power to find out why. This has to end. Ew! 
Thanks for the image, Nathan. And everybody here thinks Samuel is a creeper? You know you're hurting when you don't give a shit about music. I did save Kate. I did. No way can I clean that shit off. Time to get Samuel da Vinci to repaint. <sighs> Kate's okay, Max. Take a breath. Get your shit together. You have time. Stop it, Marco. Hazel wouldn't eat the bunny. Mushu might. Hazel. Okay, this is scary dark. Let there be... That's a depressing thought. And it's always about Victoria. Everybody thinks that. I don't see it. So much hypocrite. Do they really need that crap on the door? Kate's still alive. You got a puppy? Aww. Hey, can you come in here for a minute? Hey, Dana. How are you doing? Better than Kate. I just can't believe she would even attempt suicide. I knew she was depressed, but I had no idea how bad. Must be serious to throw yourself off the roof. Kate was serious, but it's not all about that video. So what exactly are you saying, Max? You think this has something to do with Nathan being expelled? It's complicated. I don't want to drag you into this, okay? Not yet, anyway. I'm getting scared now. But I people here are still sneaking out tonight. What? Like, who? Victoria bounced out of here earlier, and now you, Sherlock? Not me. I need a break from today. Get some sleep too, Dana. I'll see you later. Yes, the Vortex Club does indeed suck. Ah, oh, Victoria isn't here. Maybe I'll just wait and bide my time. Going through her shit. That's supposed to be a hint that I should go through her shit. Get her room down here. Victoria is about as straight as me, but she really appreciates style. These socks cost more than my wardrobe. Hey, Brandon. I'll title this one, Portrait de la Assholes. Whoa, there's Kate. Totally high. She looks confused. Not like she's partying. Here they are getting loaded with Satan. That's a lot of bank just to clean paint from a sweater. $30. Victoria's Secret. She's a geek. There has to be some dirt in here on Vic. Well, well. Victoria and Taylor actually show remorse. This is like a thread for sociopaths. Max Crackfield? Lame. Party on, dudes.
parents have lost their shit and are threatening me with a fucking job in my dad's office. Oh no! He has to work! I got to see you having me repping him. Next crack field. Blackwell need to go fucking down and the end of the world party is fucking on you in. You okay? Shit. That's just true. First time I saw her ass kicking. Ass kissing, not ass kicking. Whoops. Mr. Jefferson with that retro camera. Notice that everybody she hangs around gets in trouble. And yes, the Vortex will be bringing the end of the world to Blackwell no matter what. Just hang in there. I hate that guy. And that bitch. First Rachel and now Kate? This is the end of the Vortex Club. A unique point of view is right. Thanks to Courtney Wagner ghostwriting this paper. Hi, Britt. How are you guys find? I'm assuming that, uh... <sighs> Nothing to see here. I guess I shouldn't be so bummed. Not that Victoria couldn't hide her shit. Man, <sighs> I'm getting paranoid. Uh. We had a skunk in our garage earlier, <laughs> so there's that. Oh, I'm, I'm assuming it's out, but I don't know. Tree! Hi! Hi, Trunus! So Chloe is waiting for me in front of the main hall. The most magical insects. Burn bright. Me? Maybe Samuel should fix that lamp. What up, step it? The Tabanga does look pretty scary at night. Please don't destroy me. I thought she said Tabanga at first. But what a cool name. Make you a superhero suit on live three printer kind of cool. <laughs> A whore. Then the Nazis will be exterminated. Watch out. How is she a whore? I think it was they. Oh, crispy. Rip. Nobody can expel me. Not yet, anyway. So... Oh, it's unlocked. I hope Sammy wasn't around. Nothing here. I know Samuel doesn't wear silky scarves. So, who does? Oh god, I'm frightened about what I'm gonna find here. Who knew Samuel was so into runway fashion? He did, Trunus, that's what I was thinking. Uh, Gilberto, I mean... It's kind of hard to explain. I'm sure somebody in chat could explain a little bit. It's kind of complicated so far. <laughs> Hi, Solid. Um, not really TJB. I played it like the three days on stream and that was all I've played so far. Nuts and bolts. <laughs> like my grandpa's <laughs> garage.
Uh, rip. Thank you. Nothing but tools. Anything. Oh, cat, how are you? I just feel want to do something like with this squirrel here. Or no. Confused. I will not lie. He's lucky nobody else saw him like that. Except me. Yeah. Miss Caulfield, you have to be stealthier than that. You're not supposed to be outside your dormitory at this hour. You know that. I I'm sorry, Principal Wells. I'm still tense after I thought Kate was going to jump today. I just needed some air and space to walk. No, no explanations. Seeing Kate come up on that roof, then seeing her come down with you. You saved her ass. <sighs> Maybe saved Blackwell. Now don't get cocky. Going back inside. You earned good dreams. Great. So how do I get past him to meet Chloe? Mm. Well, nothing bad happened. Uh, 
Uh, see you later, Tit. Um, what did you miss? Um, so far, not much. I haven't been. I haven't done much this episode yet because I'm very unsure of where to go. Gosh, yeah, I don't think that's such a good idea. Shaker, why you do this? Punching him in the face isn't a good idea, is what I'm saying. Did I miss something in here? I don't think I did. Nothing here. Nuts and bolts. <laughs> like my grandpa's garage. Nothing else is popping up. If I could reach, we can do it now. That's what I thought too, but it wouldn't let me do anything with it. So I wonder if it will now. Maybe I just have to go through that. Here, I don't know how to get to that one either. I can't get through this. First, we were a little confused on what to do here. Set of keys on me somewhere. Ah. Max the ninja strikes again. Why won't they I thought it was shift. That's what I've been holding this whole time anyway. Arms are sweaty. He's weak. Get it? Boo, yeah. Like I'm a scary punk ghost. More like a scary punk asshole. 
Hey, Chloe, I didn't exactly have the greatest day trying to keep my friend from jumping off the roof. I don't think I need you to prank me tonight, okay? Sorry, but you absolutely balls to the walls did save your friend. Kate saved herself. I couldn't even use my power. My head felt like it was being crushed. And then I had no clue what to say to her on that roof. Don't be so modest, Rockstar. Kate is alive because of you. You obviously said the right thing. And your badass power is going to save us all. We just need to connect the plays. And find out who almost killed Kate. We have to stop this from happening to anybody else. Oh yeah, and somehow stop that tornado from wiping out Arcadia Bay, right? I hope so, Chloe. But how? Snow and Eclipse are bad omens. This whole town is a bad omen. And notice that Blackwell seems to be ground zero. Chloe, I just feel weird about some of my decisions. Especially after I just got Nathan expelled. Dude, do not even torture yourself like that. Let's focus on looking for clues, okay? I know, Christy. Right. For one thing, there's too much coincidence between the people around Kate and Rachel. Like Step Prick and Nathan Prescott? Not just them. Yep. I just want to beat the shit out of those particular bros. And even though I don't know her, it feels like Rachel is guiding us to the truth. Fuck the truth. I just want to find my friend right now. It scares me to think where she could be. Do you think she's... Alive? I have to think that, Chloe. Her spirit is so powerful here. Maybe too much power. Max, we have to find Rachel soon. We have to. I promise you we will. Like you said, it's time to start the search for clues. Now tell me what's your secret. Drum roll, please. I present the spare keys to Blackwell. Thank you, step prick. You are such a boss, Chloe. I just don't want you to get into any more trouble. Look at all the trouble dropping in Arcadia Bay. At this point, who gives a fuck anymore? We're in it to win it, Max. Lead the way. I'm so glad you're my partner in crime. As long as you're my partner in time. Insert groan here. Thank you again so much for helping me put together a portfolio. Hopefully the rest of the class will follow your lead. I'm sorry I was distracted. Sure. As you know, it's not been a good day for Blackwell. I know this has been an awful day, and you can talk to me anytime, Mr. Jefferson. Thank you, Victoria. I'm glad it had a relatively happy ending. I don't know what I would have done if Katie jumped. Katie? I had no idea you two were that close. Did she? Well, how does this affect the Everyday Heroes contest? It doesn't. The contest is still a go, and I still have to pick the winner to best represent Blackwell. I've got all the photos, except one from Max. I'll give you a one-word sneak preview of Max's photo. Selfie. Listen, you've seen my entry. You know it's better than that. Wouldn't that be so cool to hang out together in San Francisco, Mark? Stick to Mr. Jefferson, Victoria, please. And, uh, I haven't picked a winner yet. You already love my work, so it's not like you're playing favorites. Just imagine if you picked my photo, though. We would have to spend a lot of time together. That could be fun, don't you think? I'm going to think that you didn't say any of that. You might as well choose me. Otherwise, I might have to tell people you offered to choose my photo for favors or something. As a favor to your future, I'll also ignore that undisguised threat. This conversation is officially over, Miss Chase. I suggest you go back to your dorm now. Wait! I only... Bye, Felicia. Are you fucking kidding me? It's so stupid. Just when I think Victoria can't get any more evil. Shit is about to get real at Blackwell. Let's go find out. Fine, not Kenyon. Um, I have to be up early tomorrow and work all day, so... 
I can't stay on for too long tonight. Chloe the Keymaster. You know it. I still can't even. Victoria. Dude, I don't know about this. We're both already in so much trouble. Not to mention the weed you brought into my room. Joking. I'm serious. We're not kids anymore. We're breaking and entering. If I have a key, how can it be breaking? We can't charge us for just entering. I'm serious. No, I work we all could day go now. to jail. Not if I'm related to the head of Blackwell security. Step shit will not want me in the hands of the local police. So we better find out what's in the principal's office first. You can rewind if we get caught, right? You have mad powers, Max. But my powers didn't save Kate. Maybe I did on my own. Come on. One more door and our work here is done. Um, wait, I tweeted that my schedule changed. I haven't put it on here yet. That's it. What the fuck? The security officer should have the key to the principal's office. He's hiding shit. Like everybody here. Well, now we definitely have to get this door open. Believe it or not, I know a little about lockpicking. Thanks to Frank. I might as well test out my thief skill. Go for it. We're already in this deep. Well, you could look for the key. Just in case. Why, yes, I could. Dead end. Nothing here. Hi, Battlefield of this life. Brittany, no. You cannot. Boring. Crap. Only a total phony would wear a crappy hat like that. I feel bad for the twee hipster who lost this beret. I bet he's cute. No keys here. Nothing to see here. No key for thee. We have to find another way in. Guess I didn't spend enough time with Frank. But I'll use my DIY lockpick tools while you come up with a better plan. My plan has a name. Hey, Warren, you busy? Just bubble hearth, you'll be okay. Listen, I need your physics expertise stat. Without naming names, if somebody had access to the art and science labs and wanted to construct a device that would, say, open a locked door, would you maybe kind of know how? Huh? No, I'm just asking for fun. Thanks, science guy. Uh, no, 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 stay. We need you as backup. Just send the text instructions now. Yes, I'm still all There's in to go ape right with there. you at the drive-in. Thanks for the help. This sucks ass. Goddamn door. Try not to wake up everybody at Blackwell. Sorry, Max. I got nothing. What about your plan? I'm gonna go put it together. Can you stay here and not get caught? I might get on the other side of that door before you, Lupin. The race is on. See you soon. Terrifying. This is how you do it. Alright, so we can duct tape. Warren is such a classic nerd. Let's see if I can find those items. What do you know? Trash. Hey, Labaka. It's all good.
nothing in it. Just emptied. Nothing here. Silently the door through. Release the crack hand. It's all mine anyway. Only three more items to go. So glad you still have your locker, Kate. Why does everybody hate on Max all the time? For shit's sake. You guys. You're an artist, damn it, not a scientist. But this is so not sodium chlorate. Here's the sodium chlorate box. So, sodium chloride is a weed killer. You'd think Warren would have told me that factoid. Crispy. <laughs> uh. Everybody's asleep. I hate to wake them up, but I want a picture. Good evening, fish fish. Thanks, fish. Nice work. It was a good, it was a good clip. Please resume your slumber. I never said they were great, troll. I had sex with your mom. So Dr. Max did help Warren this morning. You duct tape? Ooh, sugar. Brittany, You're I'm halfway sorry. home, Max. Ass biology. Ugh, gross. This mixture doth not work. You know you're clumsy, Max. Don't waste your rewind power. Use the damn chair. Ingredient left. Every. OMG chair hype. You guys are. There's a can 
stand right there. It's perfect. This is like a scene in a horror film. Oh, Kate. Even when you were sad, you tried to see the good in the world. Shit. No, I did too, Josh. Victoria, that is pretty fucking sweet. How can I hate somebody that shoots like that? Daniel's a better illustrator than photographer, <laughs> said Max, the art critic. I probably should find those items now. I feel gross even looking at Nathan's work, but he does have some style. I don't know where the janitor's room even is. Victoria's cigarettes? <laughs> I'm sure Mr. Jefferson is impressed. I just figured there had to be there some dove tape. Hell yeah. The tape is mine. Now it's time to show Chloe that Max is the bomb. Very frightened. Hey, pipe. Take it easy on the door, Chloe. Let's try this instead. Boom! Literally. Yes! Time to blow shit up! If you'll light the candle. This is so cool! That's what I was thinking, Crispy, but what do we know? Get ready to haul ass. That was so fucking cool! Oh, we have toast! Here comes the whole Arcadia Bay Fire and Police Department. Uh, so what should we do? Here are the keys. None for the principal's office. That's both drunk anyway. Take it easy on the door, Chloe. Let's... Damn, I missed something. I better rewind. Oh, I think I get it. Hold on. Ah. If I can get this bastard open, she can't cheat with her rewind. Oh, this is bullshit. Fuck you, door. Welcome to my domain. You are magic! I have no clue how the hell you got in there, but you did it, sister. The company I keep. Now, let's find what we want and beat it. My powers only go so far. 
Man, I can see why the principal locks this room up. Fancy faux art crap. He must want everybody to know he has money, but no taste. I did. Dickwan, why is that? Dick, I don't know how to say it. How can you trust somebody who has a fucking bronze bird in his office? I'm glad I was expelled. Yes, if only the principal had a Monet or Picasso, you'd still be at Blackwell. Eat me. I'm gonna pill for the papers on this ugly ass desk. Okay, I thought maybe I'd miss something in the key. Okay, sure. It's ugly, but damn, is it a cozy chair? She's doing a lot of work. This is your chance to truly get all deductive and shit, Sherlock? Find us some clues about Rachel, or Kate, or Nathan, anybody. Nice. I'm on the case. This pretty much sums up Kate. Shy and sweet. And in the wrong place. Present time, there's a security investigation. Controversial video, allegedly featuring Kate Marsh. Party has been uploaded onto the internet without her knowledge or Legend, along with her claim of parties. GPA 3.9. Probably wise, okay. That I can say. That I can't say. Huh. So he knew about it as this letter from. The nurse says she was depressed, but the fucker didn't do anything about it. Only two more files to go. Oh. Hey! Look! Listen. Wise! Taquan Wise, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Sam Pam. I appreciate it. I certainly can't use this. Wowzer, this will so not come in handy. I'd drink too if I was the principal of Blackwell. Drinking on the job, you know. And nothing here. Rachel doesn't seem so troubled based on all this. But there's not much here about the police investigation. Unfortunately, Rachel Amber has stopped attending class before month and she left no contact with students or faculty for the past month. Her parents are at the present and aware of her out whereabouts and Blackwell hopes for her quick return to continue her academic um yeah crispy pretty awesome why does everybody always think I'm quiet I haven't changed anything Nothing. Not a thing. Haru, how are you? Well, she know Rachel Amber's investigation has officially been closed on our end. We always hope for that one magic clue, but once again, our KKB covers up another secret. Man, I don't blame the principal for expelling Chloe. Bad Chloe. 1.7. It's not even that, f it's literally right here. Right here. It's, it's literally like, you just can't see the tip of it. It sounds fine for everybody else when it's farther away. Let's nab this last file, Sherlock. Holy shit, Shaker. I always wanted to say <laughs> Thank you, Shaker. For the twenty dollars, OMG, hi, big fan here, please, please, Jaker, please, thank you, Jaker, I appreciate it. Even though you try to steal my boyfriend, it's fine. It's fine. No big deal. Weird. This asshole has a spotless record. What a dick. Like I'm not gonna read my own personal file. 2.8. $20 D, shaker hype. 
Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Oh, some complaints find her too nervous and nosy. <laughs> Ah, shaker. Ah. Kevin! <laughs> you guys are hurting my feelings here. Hey, look, her number starts with 555. Both of them. Rue, her numbers are fake. <laughs> this file is going to be so spotless, a projectile vomit. 3.9, the gold standard, slut. I have to make sure Warren doesn't have a criminal background. Four point oh, what a genius. Rue, you stop. I think we found everything in here. I should go join Chloe now. So Nathan Prescott's dad is a bully too. In light of the Shocker. recent outrageous allegations against my son and his suspension, I feel that my large contributions to Blackwell Academy should also be suspended. Of course, the situation can be rectified once Nathan is reinstated at Blackwell with a written apology. Along with that, I understand that the tragic event involving Miss Marsh gives you pause, but I would suggest that canceling Thursday's party is not conductive to the can-do spirit of Blackwell Academy. I expect you to reconsider and come to the same obvious conclusion. What a dick. I, I don't remember, Crispy. I do not remember. But it's been like this for quite a few streams, and nobody said anything until like yesterday. Not yesterday, Tuesday. That was the first time anybody said anything about it. So, I don't know. Gold standard for a slut. Oh. Oh. I don't know, man. I do not know. Max, you better come check out these files. Nathan accuses Rachel of bringing drugs on campus, and my step troll went along because he thinks Rachel was a bad influence on me. Assholes. If David is teaming up with Nathan Prescott, that's a bad sign. Nathan Prescott the third. Ooh, he's so money. And you know the Prescotts dropped major bank to bury Nathan's real file. Look, it reads like a rap sheet. Bad grades, teacher complaints, secret probation. But I was expelled? At least Nathan was finally suspended. Check out that note. Open it. Um, that's because I was further it's away just some from crazy drawing. Probably. It's not a drawing. Look. Rachel in the dark room. Rachel in the dark room. Over and over. That's it. That's... Fucked up. What does this even mean? Nathan is truly psychotic. I know he has something to do with Rachel missing. Whoa, listen to this. David M. always asks what's going on in my head. David M. always helps me follow those he follows. It's <sighs> pretty cryptic. No, it sounds like they formed some sort of weird team, the Super Hebros. Jesus. David was stalking Kate, hassling me, and now we know he was all over Rachel, too. Oh, we are so going into his garage files. Plus, I'm getting a little paranoid in here. We got our info. Let's bail. But maybe we shouldn't leave without a gift. No, you are not taking the cozy chair. Max, do your powers include mind reading? Or did you just rewind because I tried to steal the chair? Shit, I'm confused. It's the powers of best friendship. I know how you roll. We should definitely get out of here. We pressed our luck enough. Hello, what have we here? Holy shit! Jackpot! Cha-ching! Wow, sir. That's a lot for the handicapped fund. Dude, there's $5,000 here. I could pay Frank back tonight. This will chill him out after you almost, you know, shot him. Are you gonna make a big issue out of this? Or just rewind and take the greenbacks for yourself? I hope you do that instead of lecturing me. Do we leave it or do we steal it? Shit. Oh my god. Stealing from candy kept kids is terrible. 
But otherwise, I'm afraid that guy's gonna try and kill me. Everybody's saying take it. Except like two people who are like stealing from handicapped kids. Buy a new outfit. Oh my god. I don't think I can do it. You really want to take money from the handicapped fund? I know you need to pay Frank back, but I've got my power to protect you, right? There's a lot of power in that horse choking wad of cash. But yes, Moral Max is right again. I guess. Let's get the hell out of this office, Morg. Don't get all pissy with me, woman. I know that money would have helped Chloe and me. I left it. Calm down. That impish look scares me. Care for a midnight swim? The Blackwell pool is ours. Swimming? You want to take that risk now? It's been a cray week. You didn't let me take that money to pay off Frank, so if he pops a cap in my skull, at least allow me to have a little carefree fun for a few minutes. Splish Splash? You're right. We have to stop it. Splish Splash. Did you actually just say Hella? I think I'm a good bad influence on you. Hella. Frightened. We're in the otter's lair. Big fucking deal. I want that heated water. We still have to play it cool, okay? I still go to school here. You can own this hellhole once you figure out your rewind power. Chloe is so psyched for girls' night out, so I better follow her evil plan. Boys or girls? Girls, of course. Girls. Ooh la la. <laughs> Let me check to see if the pool's heated. I hope the otters will survive. If only I could solve the mystery of the missing cat picks. That was that note that we saw that had cat pics on. I actually don't have the time to investigate this caper. Lost goggles. Oh no. Sock. Where does that other sock go? Those look like the most cozy, comfy towels in towel history. One, flippers in a swimming pool? I saw. Are they training Navy frogmen here? Love you. I'm trying to feel better. I still feel a little bit meh. A bus ticket? Was she going to run away? Like Rachel Amber? Oh, it's Kate's locker. Victoria's locker, hmm? So, Victoria's secret is selfies. <laughs> Go fuck your... No. Jefferson said, don't confuse art with the artist. Go fuck yourself. These are cool shots. Girls are icky. Oh, the wit, it burns. This isn't a desperate cry for attention or anything. Sorry, Rachel. Can I rewind that part? Well, we care, dickhead. 
I hope so, friend. If I can rewind that part, though, I could. Take a dump in her locker. Perfect. Boys or girls? Boys, of course. Figures. Perv. Huh? <laughs> Let me check to see if the pool's heated. I did shift and it worked. I tried spacebar, it didn't do anything. I think it's shift. This must be for training kids. Must be. No way am I touching Zach's jersey. Don't phone it. Zach is really careless. Doesn't he know what happens when I'm around? Hey, thinking bad things about you. Cool. What are you wearing? Just my crystal necklace and phone. Ot. What are you wearing? I'm in locker room, only wearing a jersey, sitting on my football. Oh, baby. These people. It is generic dog. It totally is. Whatever, Shaker. It's okay. Betty developed that in Jefferson's class. But why? Hella hot. <laughs> it's okay for Nathan to be hooked on these drugs, right? Yeah, it's totally fine. I guess somebody forgot their Blackwell spirit. I guess I should consider this evolution. Dana, I know I'm an a-hole, but I still care about you. Love, Logan. Hi, Fitz. Joshy. Uh, Sometimes. No worries. It's all bad. That's depressing. Sex me up. Boys locker room is right. Victoria loves the D. Huh. It's nice to know Victoria loves <laughs> something besides herself. Welcome to 1950. I bet you do. Oh my god, Sherrick. <laughs> Dana needs a baby daddy. This one is almost empty. The guys must like their pink goo. Max Caulfield, Moral Avenger. Or self-righteous hypocrite. Both. Bros will be bros. I don't think anybody has ever drowned here. I hope. Don't think anybody has ever drowned here, but... Yes, we get it. Oh Otters. Gosh. Victoria is girl streamer. You know. Coffee and swimming. Good combo. Don't even think I'm gonna make a move on you. <laughs> Left to Victoria for her to kick in right Now I have the power over light and death. Max, try to find the light for the pool. I want to see the sharks. Otters don't like sharks. They bite. So do I. Hit that light. There has to be a control panel for the lights around here. That was bright. I 
In case I run out of air, I know where to come. She got in time to do or dive, Max. <laughs> oh yeah, baby, it feels like a hot tub. Too bad you made me feel like the queen of assholes because I wanted that cash stash. Tell me you're not gonna stand there watching me like a zombie. Crispy. Don't you dare! Come stop me, hippie! Okay, you asked for it. Cowabunga! Why, look, an otter in my water. Dun 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 dun. You are so obvious. And I still get freaked out by that movie, so stop. I can't even watch any of those shark shows. <laughs> if there are any children, please avert your eyes. <laughs> I'll just rewind and harpoon you. Otter's revenge. Cheater. Yeah, you wouldn't know about that. <laughs> I need an adult. <laughs> I wish Rachel was here. She would totally love being in here at night. Oob. Wish you guys had met each other. We will. With all this stuff going on, I'm starting to think everything is related. And I want to find out for Kate's sake. She almost died today. Your power is changing everything, Max. Especially you. I can already tell. You're not so chicken shit anymore. Thanks, girlfriend. You know what I mean. You're becoming like... This force of nature. More like luck of nature. A heated pool feels like a hot Come place. on, my power failed trying to rescue Kate. Maybe I'm just stumbling back and forth in time. For what reason? You didn't stumble when you saved me, Max. Thank God. But what if I had? What if Kate didn't jump, but you would be dead? So it's time to start moving forward in time. And we're obviously connected, since without me, you would have never discovered your power, right? Absolutely. You make me feel like I know what I'm doing. They're having a moment. And you make me feel like I have a reason for still being in Arcadia Bay. I hope so. Stop being so goddamn humble. You're like the smartest, most talented person I've ever known. More than Rachel Amber? Dude, I'm not her groupie, okay? And I'm sure you have Blackwell bros all over you. Like Warren. Warren is... nice. <laughs> nice? Ouch. That means friend zone. No, he's really cool. It was so sweet when he stood up to Nathan. I but I haven't told him about my rewind power. Uh, no worries. Once you get over yourself, you're gonna make the world bow. As long as you're there with me. Don't look so sad. I'm never leaving you. Aww. Now I'm getting cold in here. Because we're yapping instead of attacking each other, otter versus shark style. I uh, think I've had my pool experience for the year. Let's jet. <laughs> Let's call it a draw. I'm gonna freeze my ass off when I get out. I feel like we just went swimming in Chlorine Bay. You look cute with your hair soaked in chemicals. Thanks. You would know. Shit. Hide! Move, Max! Don't waste your power on getting busted! Are you shitting me? Dude, hide! Like when we were kids. I could use my power. Or just look for a hiding spot. Or both. Where are they? Where are they? 
are they? Why can't I hide? Hello? Where are they? Hello? Hello? Anybody there? Better not try any Halloween pranks after today. I'm serious. Better not try any Halloween pranks after today. I'm serious. I heard something over here. Who's here? I got I got a flashlight and a stick. Oh shit. Who's here? I got I got a flashlight and a stick. Flashlight and a stick, you guys. We are so invisible. Let's bail. <laughs> Whose footprints are these? <laughs> what happens when you turn the stinking lights on? Wait, turn around. They're coming. We have to find another way out. Oh, this is bullshit. You can't go back to your dorm now. You're a Blackwell fugitive. Crash at my place tonight. You want me to crash where the Blackwell security officer lives so I'll be safe? Uh, okay. Into the car! Get in! Yeah, no shit, Chris, that's what I'm saying. He would know. She yelled later, fuckers. Aw, man. Eat. Kiss her, do it. Always remember this moment. Photo bomb. Photo hog. She's entirely too happy for just waking up. It feels like a different world from yesterday. We left a skid mark on Blackwell last night. Like it needs another one. <laughs> Crispy. I'd like, like to do this. something good for my school in Arcadia Bay. I can't even submit my photo to represent. I just don't want to be rejected. 
every great artist gets rejected before they get accepted. So you have to enter a photo. Even though I'm pimping the school in town you want to torch? Come on, I don't want to see Arcadia Bay burn to the shore. I just say shit like that because I've been trying to get out of here since... since you left, basically. If I could find Rachel, then pay Frank off. I'm still leaving to start a whole new life. Wish we could just hang out all morning like we used to. Maybe we should get up. I have to get back to Blackwell soon. Oh, does the schoolgirl have a test today? I'm starting to feel like going to Blackwell every day is a test. I just need to get on my regular school schedule again. Get dressed now. I don't think I'll be washing today. They're not figure, it's a joke. I wish I was a grill like Chloe. I'm lucky David didn't bust me for acting like it was my pot. Chloe is so damn what cute. Up, Sean? She's really trying to suss out what my vision means. I thought Chloe might put up a pic of me instead. Can't compete with Rachel. This chick. Holy shit balls. Frank is scary. I should have let Chloe take that money. No, you have heavy oh, and that's Ugh. real. It still reeks like a chlorine factory. See if you can find a suitable outfit in my fashion hall. Okay, time for some Basically. Chloe cosplay. Easy. Hey, there you go. Rachel left a bunch of her clothes with me. She's your size. But not quite my style. I don't know, Rashad. Max, you don't have a style yet. At least give it a try. You can always rewind back to your chlorine brand t-shirt and generic jeans. You suck. I like my shirt and jeans. I really like how her but hair But it would be cool actually. to try on Rachel's clothes just to see if they fit. Stop second-guessing yourself, Max. Put this on and let your inner punk rock girl come out. You can afford to take chances whenever and whatever you want to try. For example, I dare you to kiss me. Ooh. What? I double dare you. Kiss me now. She wants the V. I'm good, Nazril. How are you? Damn. You're hardcore, Max. Now I can text Warren and tell him he doesn't stand a chance. Unless he's into girl and girl action. You're such a dork. We're in. Um, that was priceless when I kissed Chloe. She didn't think I would. You guys honestly think I wasn't gonna do it? Of course I did it. Sex her. It's like he is here. I get it. Didn't give me that option. It was just a kiss. I don't want two boyfriends. I just want overdrive. Looking sick, Max. I want that shirt, tats, actually. Some piercings, and we'll make a thrasher out of you yet. Ready for the mosh pit, Shaka bra. Maybe not. <laughs> Go on down and say hi to Joyce. Free breakfast? I have to, uh, wake and bake first. I promise not to tell. Let's not rewind and find out, okay? I would honestly wear any of Chloe's clothes, too, that she's worn. She's pretty much the same thing. Just saying. I need new clothes. Oh my god, that smells so amazing. It's like when we were kids here. Zero to 100 real quick. You're the only one who was there for me at school, the only one who truly cared. I have to believe that you were sent to give me hope. You did so much more than that. My father is grateful as well. He'll always be in our prayers. Love and blessings, your friend Kate. Aw. Crispy. <laughs> we're having a baby. 
Now, can we get her to do something with her hair, too, please? Seriously, though, I want that shirt. That's real. <laughs> It feels so good to wash my face after all that chlorine. What made you spat and your drink? Hiding. Crispy, was it the we're having a baby thing? I don't know. I just don't know. My mom said the same thing, Shaker. Nobody's really having a baby. Max and Chloe are having a baby because they did it. <laughs> Everybody's freaking out. Guys, I was talking about the game. It was a joke. Because Crispy said, take Max to Walgreens for a pregnancy test. Okay, Crispy. You go and <laughs> you record that. I give you permission. Send it to me too so I can hear it because it's funny. Good morning, Joyce. Rachel. Ugh. I mean, Max. Oh, you startled me. Well, you fit those clothes well. Thank God you're not a hellraiser like her or Chloe. Now tell me exactly what you want to chow on. Mm, I'm going pancakes. I'm dying for some of your famous pancakes. I thought you would have missed those. Ah, you ate more than we. The William. time is 1.32, so it was a little them. before 1.32. <laughs> I remember. We would race each other to grab them from the stack. So this time, you can help me with the ingredients. I need you to grab me the eggs and milk. Make eggs and milk? This. No problem. I love that they still have the same refrigerator. What? I can't, I can't grab things out of there? Oh. There's milk. Now for the mother's milk. I don't want eggs. Um, hello, eggs? Anywhere? Come on, Max. Find those ingredients so we can chow down. Eggs? Hello? I love that they still have the same refrigerator. Why can't I open the refrigerator? Where are the eggs? What kind of house is this? Wowzer. Chloe still eats the same cereal. So do I. Crispy, what a jerk. Ugh, tree. Seriously, am I missing something here? Eggs. Eggs. Like, hello? Can't open the fridge. Milk was just on the counter. If I were eggs, where would I be? Check the bathroom, that's the only logical place I can think of, to be honest with you. Oh, jeez, can you help me get this bird out of here? Bird? Any bird? I think this chick is crazy. I keep expecting to see the sky turn red. Seriously. Where are the damn eggs in this house? Where? I passed the eggs? Where? The newspaper? I see a bottle. Eggs are in the Xbox. That makes sense. Seriously, though, I don't, I don't, I can't open any of the cabinets. Not giving me that option. Um, maybe vivid. I 
I have quite a few, I just don't really like to Eggs! Ha ha! I found the them! The eggs always come first, as Joyce used to say. Shaker, you're too late, I already found them. Sucker. The eggs are in the house? Nuh-uh. Nuh-uh. Thanks. After all these years and everything that's happened, it's great to see you and Chloe together again. Yeah, we just but She hasn't school. had a good friend since you or Rachel. Oh, those clothes remind me so much of her. Such a sweet girl. I'm just hoping she's living large in L.A. I'd love to think that too, Joyce, but... We are on the same page, Max. I keep hoping that Shaker. Rachel will show up or even send a message to Chloe from Hollywood. Or wherever she is. Be honest, Joyce. Do you think Rachel is okay? Shaker, we love you. Oh, God, I hope so. She was... Is smart. She always landed on her feet. Maybe I don't know her as well as I thought. Maybe Chloe doesn't either. Sometimes I feel like I don't know Chloe as well as I thought. <laughs> Max Caulfield, are you actually jealous of Rachel? Well, Cat, okay, you said something about a cabinet. They weren't on a cabinet. They were in a bag. Rachel is the friend who's been missing. Crispy, where have you been? Yes, Seaman, I believe so. Your ga your decisions affect everything. What? <laughs> no way. I know I was selfish when I left. Crispy, thanks for the hug. I'm glad so we found a better friend. No, what? just what? a different one. Last time I saw you and Chloe in your pirate outfits, I knew she would never find a better friend. And when you took the rap for that joint, you proved it. Thanks. Where is she? But it seems like <laughs> Chloe and me were pirates a thousand years ago. And that makes me what? A century old? <laughs> You're only 18, Max. Oh, youth. Oh, youth. If only I could go back. It's not all that, Joyce. Voila. A breakfast fit for us queens. And a king. <laughs> go sit at the table. Oh. Whoops. Hello. I have to sit at this chair. I guess nobody waters the plant here. Oh man, I don't want to be famous for this. Thank I'm glad that's creamy and not crunchy. Good, you can clean. Yes, crispy, exactly. Now that's what I call Look pancakes. At those. Oh my god, I want pancakes. Crunchy peanut butter. Seeing you again ah oh, made me remember so much. I know these photos don't measure up to your work, Max. Me too, Chuck. My favorite photographers probably take pictures similar to yours. You make David happy, Joyce. He wants us all to be happy, Max. He's just not great at showing it. Uh, I don't think I can rock this outfit like Rachel. You have your own cool style. Wow, so that's good. I totally remember that day. I'm glad. William took this picture with his instant camera. <laughs> oh, it was the last picture he ever took. He had his car out right after this and... and... I know, Joyce. I'm sorry. I didn't show you this to be morbid. In fact, I want you to have this. This was when my baby was so full of life and light. She was hopeful, positive, 
and everything she's not today. And this was the last time I ever saw Chloe truly happy. Did you guys have a bonding session about how fucked up I am? Probably so. It's not always about you. Chloe, please. It's too early to start picking a fight. Eat instead. I'll keep the warden busy while you go peek in the garage. Now stop whispering or I'll know you're talking about me. Stop being so nosy, mother. Jeez, I can't do anything around here without everybody getting up in my shit. Oh, no one can even joke with you, Chloe. You fly off the handle like that. Excuse me. I have to use the bathroom. Sure, run off and pee when you should back me up. Now, who's being paranoid? Just listen to yourself. Nobody else does. Yeah, because uh, I work both jobs. I do tomorrow. need to get into David's computer. He's got to be hiding shit. I have to work in the morning, then I have to work at night, and I'm not excited. No shit, it needs a password. How about step douche? Try again. I need more clues. Maybe I could try stepdad for the password. Chloe, I'm so happy you were born today. Nothing to see here. Try again. That's really funny, Rue. <laughs> oh my god. Naturally, David would buy a heavy duty military padlock. Injured. I can even see the combination. That might be a useful password. 171. Worst hacker That was ever. way longer than 7171, by the way. There's no way Chloe can put that gun back now. Huh. Maybe this ID number might work. Uh -huh. Who's oh, shit balls. Shit balls. Oh god, I hit the wrong button. Rip. I could try the license number for the password. Hi, Tristan. Oh, it's win. That's gotta be it. Such wrong. Oh, crap, guys. Ooh, book. Looks like David has read this a lot. What did he learn? Donate? Donate? <laughs> David has been dragging his head around since 2001? Uh-uh. Night butt rip. Come on. Run faster, please. Hi, 2K man. Hey, Google Tim. What up? Okay. 
personal. That would nope. be a really stupid password. Joyce might as well have wrote, let's get married. It was an honor having you in the diner. Nice to know that gentlemen still exist. Love to talk again with you soon. By the way, the name is Joyce, if you forgot. Ooh. That might be a useful password. Oh. Oh, hi, Guy. Shh. You think everything I do is boring. Cute. Can't picture David driving Joyce around with this on the car. What up, Sonic Boom? I'm good. How you doing? Oh, Joyce, you sleuth. Be nice to Joyce. She's a nice lady. Just married Dickwad. That's all. That's all. Was it? No, it was family. Woo! School. We're in. Max the hacker strikes again. Yeah, Whoa! Until, like, Spoiler trials. alert. Rachel definitely hooked up with Frank. But why does David care? This is sketchy. Instead of stalking Kate, David could have helped her. Kate and follow the same path to every class. Overheard Kate and Dana talking about supplies for Vortex Club party. Drugs. Watched Kate with her church group. She knows her Bible. Kate stays in bathroom longer than other students. Drugs. Saw Kate helping Jefferson after class. Don't trust grown men with goatees. Kate has kept to herself since Vortex Club party, not even church. Drugs? Try to talk to Kate about the party. She got upset and ran guilty. What the fuck is wrong with this guy? This is so wrong. Oh, creepy bastard. Rachel Amber, 18, was picked up at 2.35 p.m. at Blackwell County for possession of a controlled substance. This was reported by David Madsen, head of campus security, who witnessed her trying to hide or secure a suspicious medical bag. This officer was called in to question Ms. Amber, who responded with threats and denials. Her bag was found to contain various illegal pharmaceuticals. Rachel went to dormitory. Dormitory. Followed Rachel to Lighthouse. Makes I better tell drugs. Chloe about this now. It's just one more thing to make her sad. She has hair. Drugs. And mad. Eyes. Drugs. She breathed. She was breathing heavy. Drugs. Confirmed. Nice breakfast. David, you, you back already? I have to take a nap after writing up vandalism reports last night. What happened? Some little shit-ass punks broke into the swimming pool. This is what happens at these PC bullshit colleges. Entitled students taking over the campus. Do you know for sure it was Blackwell students? Who else would do it? And I'm gonna bust them. Jesus, em. drugs. Figures you'd be here. Is that your Rachel Amber Halloween costume? You know more about her than me. No, you and Chloe think you know more than anybody, like all teenagers. Leave Max alone, David. Stop threatening students. He threatens them with surveillance cameras so he can spy on everybody, like he spies on all of us here. Don't start, Chloe. Not now. Yeah, I'm just always no. starting shit, Jesus. right? You're a total paranoid, David. Not um, thank you for the now, Chloe. You used to call me a loser for getting kicked out of Blackwell. So who's the loser now, David? Who haven't you accused or harassed? Between your investigations into Rachel and Kate, what have you done besides get in trouble? You're a bully, David. I saw you harass Kate Marsh when she was going through hell. You could have totally helped her. 
everybody at Black Hole is a suspect to you, except for Nathan Prescott. That's why the students and faculty don't like you. You even threatened me. I do respect your service, but you don't respect hey, anybody. Yes. Uh, you were smoking pot in Chloe's room. Two That's illegal. So is spying on people in your intense. family and at your work. Why do you have photos of Kate Marsh and Rachel Amber in your files anyway? What? Is this true, Max? Yes, David. Why do you have these files at all? I find this very disturbing. I do not pew, pew. have to take this kind of interrogation. Not from you punks. Maybe you should calm down. Uh oh, you're turning on me now, huh? Of course. Women always stick together. Well, screw you. David, you better go to a hotel until we figure this out. Right, you can't kick me out of my own home. It's my home, David. Paid for and in my name. You oh, know the law, shit. right? Oh, shit. I, I thought I knew Get it, Joyce. Things. Like when I'm out flanked. Have a nice day. Chloe, for once, just please shut up. I hope Joyce doesn't hate me for tearing into David. Max, don't beat yourself up. David earned this all by himself. Understand? Oh my god, Crispy. Max, that gave me chills. And you better not rewind this one. Give her to David, nerd. Pleb. Oh, God. Listen, when I went through David's laptop, I found pictures of Rachel and Frank being more than friends. <laughs> right, no way, Max. She was just posing to tease Frank. If you're not gonna believe me, why don't we check out what Frank has in his RV? What's that gonna prove? Frank has Rachel's bracelet. What else does he have in there? Motherfucker better not have anything for his sake. Ew, that looks like poop that he was just eating. It literally looked like poop. Let's check the door. Frank gets so wasted, he sometimes forgets to lock it. Lud looks like poop. Ugh. I can't believe you hung out with him. Not anymore. We have to be casual ninjas here. <laughs> Shit, like 18. Okay, here's the plan. I'll go to the diner and distract Frank by telling him I have his money, but he needs to come with me. Then you come in and rewind so Frank doesn't see me. Then you can tell Frank he needs to check out his RV, and then you rewind after you get the key, and, uh, and... Chloe, I got this. I'll be right back. It's poop. It's an American Don't let my plan get in the way of yours. I'll try to scrounge up a Scooby snack to distract his mangy mutt. <laughs> now to find a quick and easy way to snag Frank's keys. It legitimately looked like poop. Speaking of poop, that looked like poop, but it said pop. Maxine, pop here. Sorry I haven't gotten in touch sooner. I know your mom is very proud of you for saving that girl, as am I. We have no doubt sending you to Blackwell was the best thing you ever demanded we do. It makes us so proud to read about you in the news and see actual video of you walking down the roof. Yeah, walking down from the roof. Walking down the roof? Yep. With that girl. And if you want to come back home now to relax and maybe go to a high school around here, the door is wide open. Love, Pop. Thanks, Pop. It's been a whirlwind here. I'm not ready to come home yet. Talk later. Max OXO. Yeah, Gee, we kissed a girl and we liked it. No, Crispy, she. This is where she's originally from, and her family moved to Seattle and she went to come back. To go to the school. Can I start doing that? <laughs> I don't. It's not gonna work, because my name doesn't end with an X. Fail. Good lord, Bacon. I'm ready to nosh again. Oh, but I need to get those keys from Frank. Frank Bauer stars in A Face Full of Beans. It's beans. I could chug this beer or dump it on Frank. Turn up the brain to 11, Max. How can you snag Frank's keys? I just wanted to see what would happen if I did this. I'm gonna kill you.
you show up after almost shooting me, you have serious balls, little girl. But hanging out with Chloe, playing with guns, and dressing like Rachel doesn't make you cool or tough. The fuck do you want? How do you know these are Rachel's clothes? Because she looks beautiful in them, and you look like ass. Aiming a gun doesn't make you any sexier. Grab your keys and let's check out your RV. Let's not. You fucking creep me out. In other words, Max, no keys. Maybe I could chat up that officer, or even Nathan, and then go all Groundhog Day on them until I get the info I need. There she is, Super Maxine. Drugs? That's your new nickname, around the Bay. Sorry, but you did earn it. We're all real proud really of you for helping Kate for down. Me. Thanks, Officer Barry. I was just lucky. Uh... And right on time. Kate is who counts. I'm glad you're representing Blackwell Academy. I thought Nathan Prescott represents Blackwell. Well, don't make me backwash this bacon. You know what the Prescotts represent. Taking over Arcadia Bay? You're not far wrong, Max. I heard the Prescotts are working on some new big land deals. Mr. Prescott helped out my family once a while ago. So I made a deal with him that I can't seem to get out of. Drugs? Man, if I could get one instant replay in life. I better finish my breakfast first. There she is. Super. Thanks, Officer Barry. I was just lucky. I'm glad you're representing Blackwell Academy. Well, I heard a rumor you were working for the Prescott family on the side. Jesus, doesn't this town ever shut up? I don't blame you for getting extra work. Look, sometimes I check up on the Prescott family to make sure they're doing all right. Nathan included. Keep this quiet, Max. Try interrogating somebody else, Lieutenant Caulfield. Um, but the drugs thing is because when we were going through, um, Officer Dickhead's files, like, after everything, he's like, oh, uh, she's not going to her church group. Drugs? She takes longer in the bathroom than most other girls. Drugs? Drugs? It's gotta be, right? Ah, Nathan's in here. Rachel! Uh, whatever the fuck. Uh... Oh, look! Max Amber! Nice outfit. Hey, <laughs> By the way, Nathan. thanks for getting me fucking expelled, you twee you bitch. <laughs> Lucky this is a public place. Considering we're in a public diner with a police officer right over there, you shouldn't advertise your rage, Prescott. Oh, yeah? You shouldn't have bitch snitched on me to that fucked up principal. I heard your dad hired a local cop to keep an eye out on you and Frank Bowers. Like a babysitter. Bullshit. My dad doesn't hire. He owns. And these pigs know better than to knock on me. Do they? <laughs> I hope that means Frank won't get busted. Eventually he will. Guy's into some freaky shit. He told me once he took a weird blood oath for Rachel. Uh, forget I told you that. Seriously. Now get off my crack, whore. Keep your pie holes shut. Weren't you supposed to keep your mouth shut about the blood oath Frank took for Rachel? Uh, blood oath? This. What the fuck? I never told anybody about that freaky shit. Besides, everybody knows Frank is a liar and a loser. Even Rachel did. Yet Rachel Amber hung out with him more than you. So? Rachel wanted Frank's stash. She let him take pictures, then he carries around her photo like she posed for love. Dumbass. Rach? Mm. 
I bet you hoped that Kate Marsh would stay quiet. Idiot says what? Did you drug her? You are so stupid, Max. You think you're so goddamn smart, too. Don't push me, girl. You don't want me for an enemy, understand? Do you? Calm down, dude. We're in the diner. Right. Plus, you're an adult now. I can sue your dumbass for libel. Thanks. Now fuck off, Dyke. I would... When people use Dyke as an insult, it just... Uh, I don't know, man. It gets me. You show up after almost shooting me? You know I saw that photo Rachel gave you. Uh, uh How do you know about that? Huh? Chloe, right? She just told me that one of Rachel's favorite pictures was the one she did for you. Really? Yeah, I mean, that's what I thought. She was just a natural beauty, you know? Wait, wait, let me, let me find it. Here. Judge for yourself. I'm afraid I'll have to take your keys now, asshole. You did not just do that. Give me back my keys, bitch. Give me my keys now. Bye, Felicia. Key brought. Now back to Chloe. Thanks for not really shooting me. Yeah, check out this picture of the girl who's missing that I, uh, you know. Are you shitting me? Alyssa, watch out! Quick thinking, Max. I'm so nice. I should have known. The amazing Spider Max. I couldn't have done it without Frank. Now let's get in and out. You'll need this, Max. Is that a dog? On your mark, get set. Surely a shaker. Throw! Get the treat, treat boy! I think we just made that dog our bitch. Get it? Now we can snoop in peace. But let's not waste time. The doggy is busy now, but he might come back. Damn. I thought my room was a shithole. Pizza. You're not a creepy drug dealer. Frank has issues, but he's not creepy. At least I didn't think so until I saw him with Rachel's bracelet. Crispy, I don't want to know. I'll cry if that dog... Oh, we over. could cruise everywhere in this bad boy. Can you see us heading down the coast of Big Sur and beyond? Yes, we'd be tearing up the highway. And you'd probably want me to kiss you again. Chloe, we're on a schedule. We need clues about Rachel. I know. Daydreaming. It did. You scope the area while I hack his the archetypal brain. filthy guy dishes. Frank, good to know Frank has a knife lying around. That's why Max isn't really into Warren. How can somebody girls. live like this? Max likes B. Oh. Too bad I don't have my Frank Bowers decoder ring. Are these for Frank or is he selling them? Or both? That's a pretty extreme lighter. Is Frank going to deal online now? Noob's Guide to a Web Business.
I could pry this vent open with the right tool. That's almost cute to see Frank posing with his dog. Exactly, pig, exactly. I need a tool. Okay, this vent is loose. I need something to pry it open. Ah, Rue. <laughs> That's gross. But I mean... Nice rig. Glad Frank treats something here with respect. Frank must spend all his drug money on baggies. <sighs> Recycle, dude. Of course Frank gets the munchies. This is almost as good as a set of keys. My blade will open any portal. Oh well, we have here. Oh man, Rachel and Frank's dog. I don't know if I should be touched or disturbed. Frankie B, hope you read this first thing in the morning. Sorry about last night, I was being a monstrous bitch and took it out on you and poor... I don't know what the fuck that says. There's a lot of weird shit going on in my life and sometimes I feel like I'm never going to get out of Arcadia Bay. Thank God for you. You're one of the best things I have here, and I smile when I think of us together. Let's just drive out of here forever. Love you always. I'm glad Rachel got to drive this beast. She looks genuinely happy. Rachel really did hang out with Frank. I'm learning more about Rachel than I want to know. Aw, oh, shit. Hmm. Trouble in paradise. Frank, that was not cool what you did, and don't blame the drugs. You actually scared me, and I thought you'd never chill out. Never seen you act that way. And the next time will be the last. I'm a Leo, and we don't look back. I care about you, us, so maybe we need to break our routine. Uh -oh. I have to pee so bad. Ooh, Frank's stash. Mr. Mikey. Okay, yeah, I seriously, I'll be right back, you guys. I can't. I can't. I'm back. I actually didn't take my phone with me, so I didn't check Twitter while I was on the toilet, so no drugs. It's charging, so I didn't take it. Hi, right, John, if you're still here, have a good one. Hi, Keyblade Master. Hi, Strange Senpai. Hello. Hello. Crappy Wi-Fi out here. It's taking days to download porn.
That makes me ill that Rachel posed like this for Frank. I wrote him love letters. I can't believe she was banging Frank. Rachel straight up lied to my face. Why didn't she say anything? Because she knew how you would react. And she wasn't much of a friend, huh? Just another person who shits all over me. Why does everybody in my life let me down? My dad gets killed, you bail on me for years, my mother gloms on a step fucker, now Rachel betrays me. Chloe, Rachel is missing. Nobody betrayed you. Bullshit! Who hasn't? Fuck everybody! Chloe! Keyblade. <laughs> oh, I have to sneeze. Hold on. Chloe, you can't keep blaming me and everybody for everything wrong in your life. It's so not fair. I gotta blame somebody, otherwise it's all my fault. Fuck that. It's just life. Shit happens. It's nobody's fault. Blah blah blah, as Mr. Jefferson would say. And, and Kate Marsh... Yes, Kate Marsh almost killed herself. Such sad, okay? That doesn't make me feel any better about my fucked up life. Get it? So who do you most want to blame? My fucking dad, of course. Hello? Yeah, dark theme for the win. I like Better Twitch TV. I have, I've thought about doing the emotes, I just haven't gotten around to it because I don't really know what I need to do for that. You blame William? Really? Yes, I do. Damn right. He chose to go out that door and leave me forever. Chloe. Your dad didn't choose to leave you. I know that, Max. My mom actually blames herself. Just because she wanted a ride home from work. Sometimes, even I blame her. No, you don't. Yes, Max, I do. Do you know what it's like to wait for your father to come home when you're a kid? And he never does? No, of course not. But I was with you that day. It was just a terrible accident. I wish that made me feel better. But ever since he died, my life has been dipped in shit. You don't want to hear this, but you're still here. Alive. With me. And that is no accident. You're right. I don't want to hear this. Chloe, I can't do this out on my own. I need you with me. And Rachel needs you. Still, though, <laughs> I see what you did there. Her nails match her hair. Oh my god. What is happening now? hurting my head.
Oh my god, please. Someday Dad will get one of them newfangled computers. I hope the flash didn't scare you, Max. This is a keeper. Not until I see it first. You know the rules, Dad. Max, tell him. Whoa, hey. You look totally pale. Are you okay? Yeah. I just... I have fucking uh, chills. Yeah, I'm fine. Okay, Chloe. Give me the thumbs up or thumbs down. Well... I might just allow this one into the family album. No. You're the boss. What is this? But not the cook. William is here. Daddy. Yes, and we can't. Chloe is just a kid. And serve us slackers. Am I that far back in time? You mean pancakes? In France, they call them. Crackers. I'm 18 years old French inside my 13-year-old self. If you want to eat. Breakfast. How? We. I volunteer to break the eggs. Holy shit! Smelter, hi. Do you remember how many eggs? Hi. Mom said it depends. That's true. So, how many eggs? Don't you dare question the chef. Right, like you're the real cook here? I am when your mom is away. I love William like he was in my own family. I won't let him die today. I won't. Chloe is just so damn happy and carefree. And this is the last time unless I change it. Joyce loves William so much. Out of your promotion, you get a week of two well swaffles in your own house. Yes, that's Chloe. Isn't that weird? Hello. Hey, honey. Just making a fabulous breakfast with Chloe and Max. We're all going to work at the two whales. What? Oh, I didn't know you had to get groceries. Of course, I'll come pick you up. Now I'll have an excuse to get a mocha. Be there shortly. Love you. I have to stop William from taking his car today. Ladies, I have to go rescue yonder queen at the Save Mart. She doth have many bags of delicious grub for us to feast you upon. You are ridiculous. <laughs> You'll be grateful for that someday. Shit, where are my keys? That's a dollar for the swear jar. You mean your college fund? Keys, please. Hello? Hey, honey. Just making a fabulous breakfast with Chloe and Max. We're all going to work at the Two Whales. What? Oh, I didn't know you had to get groceries. Oh, of course, I'll come pick you up. Now I'll have an excuse to get a mocha. Be there shortly. Love you. Excuse me, ladies. I have to go. Oh, yeah. I miss movie nights here. Cookies and popcorn. Bags of delicious grub for. Question the chef. Right, like you're the real cook here? I am when your mom is away. I'll let her know that. Yes, here's the two whales number. Now I can warn Joyce. Yeah, Smelter, it's been a while. Uh, hello. Hi, could I please talk to Joyce Price? Oh, she left? Damn. Uh, are you sure? Okay, sorry. Thanks. Smelter hasn't been here in a really long time, guys. Welcome back, Smelter. We missed you. Boom. Disconnected. He didn't know where they were. That's what made me think about it. Ah, oh, fuck. Hey, honey. I, I have no idea why the home phone didn't ring just now. I'm just making a fabulous breakfast with Chloe and Max. We're all going to work at the Two Whales. What? Oh, I didn't know you had to get groceries. Of course I'll come pick you up. Now I'll have an excuse to get a mocha. Be there shortly. Love you. How was it, Smelter? Excuse me, ladies. I have to go rest- Man, I remember Chloe reading this. Yonder queen at the but city. not after today. She don't have many bags of delicious grub for us to feast upon. <laughs> You are ridiculous. You'll be grateful for that someday. Shit, where are my keys? That's a dollar for 
for the swear jar. You mean your college fund? Keys, please. What a mess we made. I remember those cool drawings I did with Chloe. Ethan, that literally uh, does not uh, make any sense. You can't hide. I'm just letting you know right now. No sense. Score. Hello. Hey, honey. Just making a fabulous breakfast with Chloe and Max. We're all going to work at the two whales. What? Oh, I didn't know you had to get groceries. Of course I'll come pick you up. Now I'll have an excuse to get a mocha. Be there shortly. Love you. Chloe was so into manga. Nice hair. Hey! I wonder where she got the idea for her blue hair stream. Those Excuse me, ladies. I have to go rescue oh, yonder queen at the Save Mart. She doth have many bags of delicious Ethan, grub please, for us to no, feast while you're driving. Ridiculous. That's the stupidest You'll thing I've ever heard. Put someday. your phone down. Shit, where are my keys? That's a dollar. That's literally so stupid. Jar. You mean your college fund? Keys, please. I will time you out so you can't talk in chat. Shit, where are those keys? Another dollar for the swear jar! You're bankrupting me! I knew this thing would come in handy. How did my keys get in here? Shit, no. And no Chloe and Max wine tasting session. Dad. Don't blow it, because tonight your mother promised to make us a world famous salmon surprise with chocolate cake for dessert. Max, you'll be here too, right? She's never leaving me. That makes all of us. Oh, I can't rewind. No. I have to try. I have to. I was put here to use this power to save William for Chloe. Keys, please. Shit, where are those keys? Hey, look, Another dollar for homeless the young boy, guard. thank you for the follow. Welcome to the You're bankrupting me. It. Where the hell? Oh. Max, this is not the best time for a prank. Keys, please. Uh, I was just, um, are you sure Joyce is ready? Uh, let's just, let's just wait. I, um, uh, sorry. Here. I'll get you back someday. Fuck. I have to hide that thing? And no Chloe and Max wa- Sarah. Crap. I need to hide the keys where William won't hear his dumb beeper. Maybe in the couch? I mean, it's worth a shot, right? Hello? Hey, honey. Just making a fabulous or... breakfast with Chloe and Max. We're all going to work at the two whales. What? Oh, I didn't know you had to get groceries. I know I've seen those pictures before. Of course, I'll come pick you up. Now I'll have an excuse to get a mocha. Be there shortly. Love you. I can't put him in the toilet. The toilet's upstairs. I can't excuse go upstairs. Excuse me, ladies. I have to go rescue yonder queen at the Save Mart. She doth have many bags of delicious grub for us to feast you upon. You are ridiculous. <laughs> My family never took fun, goofy photos like this. You'll hey, Steve. I've been good. How you been? Shit, where are my keys? That's a dollar for the swear jar. Throwing you mean your college idea. fund? If this Jeez. doesn't work, I'll have to do that. <laughs> if it's even possible. Shit, where are those keys? Another dollar for the swear jar. You're bankrupting me. <laughs> Damn it.
can't put them in there. Shoot. Oh-ho! Hello? Hey, honey. Just making a fabulous Woo! breakfast for Chloe and Max. We're all going to work at the two whales. I know I had those keys right here. I know it. Forgot all about you, little buddy. Release the keys. Of course. Last time I ordered from Spy Guy Electronics. You can take the bus, right? The stop is right down the street. This I can do. Good call, Max. Oh, yeah, the bus is great. Oh, man. It comes every 15 minutes, and, and there'll be plenty of room for you and, and Joyce and groceries, and, and it'll save the environment. You sold me already. I'm off to yonder bus stop. Uh, Joyce will love this. Max, you are being so fucking strange. You feel okay? Chloe, I am awesome. We are awesome. Bye, Smelter. It was good seeing you, man. Master, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Sam Fam. I appreciate it. Hello, are you even listening, what Maxine? Even. All my friends in LA told me that Oregon What Maxine, even? But Never like Maxine. So that's why she was laughing seen the so once. I know, sorry, Mad Max. You're not pissed at me, right? Right? Do you want to go hit the girls' potty and smoke them peace pipe? I think Max is high. She's acting like so weird. You cool, Max? Nobody listened when I said we shouldn't let her in the vortex. Courtney, you don't want anybody in the club. Like, whatever, bitch. What the actual Warren. fuck? He hooked up with Stella? Oh no, this is totally fucked up. What else have I changed? Chloe. Saying your own name, dude. I'm literally so confused. She changed everything, you guys.
everybody saying so many names. Max Caulfield. Taking a break after taking Seattle by storm, huh? Hmm. We thought we'd never see you again after you left for the big city. No. I'd never do that to Chloe. Speaking of, I know she's been dying to see you. Hold on. There's a ramp. Chloe! You have a visitor! I know she's in a wheelchair, isn't she? I can't do episode four tonight. I have to work a double tomorrow. Oh my god. I saw the ramp. There wasn't a ramp before. It is super long. <laughs>